on, not on a sort of philosophical level, but on a very practical level, I think the biggest problem facing young people uh, is it, just housing in this country. I just find it's been the UK, just this aspect that, you know, there just aren't affordable homes. And most like people of my generation and my brother's generation is a bit older than me, they would leave and they would maybe buy a house and they would have a decent place to live. And I mean, I had a group of young people around my house a few weeks ago and it was just like, they just don't have decent places to live. They're flat sharing, there are people in their 30s living with their parents because they can't afford to move out. And, and I just think it's just a horrible thing in the UK that we just don't physically have enough homes. We're a wealthy country and we're not doing enough about it. And, and people might say, oh, well, housing is quite a mundane thing, but it's actually incredibly important because if you're free to move around, if you have a decent place to live, then that's really one of the most fundamental bases of your whole life. And, and I think that's a huge challenge for the, for the sort of generation who are now in their 20s and people who are sort of younger than that we're reading is just where are they going to live and will they be able to afford housing when they're older um i, I mean ha happiness is a really interesting mm. thing um i mean i have suffered from depression i've been hospitalized for a time uh when i've been very badly depressed i've been suicidal so like a lot of writers i've i've, I've suffered from depression and mental illness at times in my life and probably it may seem a little bit trite but probably the one thing that kind of keeps me sane and keeps me happy is just having having people around me, having something going on, whether it's, you know, meeting with someone, chatting to someone, going around to visit my parents and play a game of Scrabble with my mum, going to the theatre with my brother or having a party. Or, it's just the thing of just like having people around you and interacting because I think fundamentally humans are social creatures. You know, we need to be with people. And when you're a writer, I think you really have to bear that in mind because as a writer, it's very easy. I mean, I've done it. I, you know, I've done a thing where I'm finishing a book and I'm really busy and I've got a deadline. And I've almost gone five days without leaving the house other than, you know, saying hello to the, the Ocado delivery man when he delivers my food, you know. And uh, I think it's really important. So, you know, just, just friends and being sociable, I think is actually the key to, uh, to being happy.